Hi there, Wayne Mardle here. Today's Wednesday Wisdom is basically, it's a practice for you. And this counts for absolutely everyone. Now, it's my favorite practice game. And there's nothing more important in darts and to be a good dart player, in my opinion, than grouping the dart. Because once that 60 goes in, you wanna go bang, bang. Not quite so quick as that. We're, we're not all Michael Smith, are we? But if you can group the dart, no matter what target you're going for, if you put one close, you actually feel like you can use that as a marker and go straight in. So my game for you is the straight 20s game. Any segment of the 20, but not the double top. As many consecutive straight darts as you can throw. Now, the reason I love this game, it, it can take one dart, it can take 93, which is my, my best set back in 2004, five, whenever, circa that time. Uh, the reason I love it, it's great for rhythm. It's great for replication. It's great for consistency. It's great for making sure you follow through straight because all you want to do is throw straight. But then on top of that, the more straight darts you throw, the more pressure is applied. And any deflection, any deflection from like a weak dart can send the darts veering off into the one or five. And we all know about that, don't we? And the reason I love this game is that the further in you get, to your, nearer to your personal best. And bearing in mind, that personal best is set straight away. So you go up three darts, that's it. Right, you've got to beat three. Then six, nine, 12, 15. Then you get 30, 45. Then you get to 55, 60. And all of a sudden, you are thinking, why am I so nervous? This is practice. Well, that's good practice. That's what practice is all about. So, the straight 20s game, as many consecutive straight 20s as you can. And do you know what you'd be surprised about? The amount of treble 20s you hit when you're actually going for a big 20. It's amazing. 